What about the eyes? There's a lot that's been said over the years about the eyes, about looking up and to the left and down and to the right and so forth. As a professional observer, I can tell you this. You can spend hours, days, months, and weeks trying to decode eye behavior, which in fact, from the research says, may be misleading because your brain is very complex. When I look at the eyes, I look at something so simple as this. We know from research that when we like things, our pupils dilate. And a little dark area of your eye will dilate when we like something. When we don't like something, our pupils constrict. We have no control over this. In fact, there's quite a bit of research showing that babies who are several days old already begin to react to their world with pupillary dilation and constriction dependent upon how they feel about what they're seeing. What about the table? Well, at the table, if you're dealt a rag hand, this is a terrible hand, chances are your pupils will begin to constrict. Now, I have brown eyes, and my eyes are in fact very difficult to see at a table, especially if I'm looking down a sofa. And I may be dealt a monster hand, and my pupils may dilate, but people at the table may in fact not be able to see it because my eyes are dark. People with lighter eyes, they're easier to see. So if that's difficult, then what can we look for? Well, one of the things we can look for is what's called eyebrow arching. And you will see this at the poker table, not hundreds of times, but if you play enough, you'll see it thousands of times. A person is dealt a terrific hand, and as they look at their cards, their eyebrows arch. This is indicative of, a, wow, this is pretty good. Now, they don't realize that they're doing this because non-verbally, as social animals, this is usually what we do when we see someone we haven't seen in a while and are happy to see again. And we'll go, hey, Bill, how are you? Nice to see you. We naturally arch our eyes. At the table, too many players don't realize this. And even professional players I have caught arching their eyebrows when they get a monster hand. So what's the opposite? If a monster hand causes our eyes and the, to our pupils to dilate and the, the, the eyebrows to arch, what would be the opposite? Constriction. The pupils constrict when the hand is bad and when it's a rag hand, or we actually may squint a little. I've seen this many, many times where the person looks at his whole cards, looks at the flop, and all of a sudden the eyes just kind of squint a little. Very indicative, very indicative of a poor hand. Why is that? Because things that we don't like, again, cause us to constrict our eyes. Things that we like, they dilate. Joe Navarro, former FBI special agent, I amplify. Do you?